Let's take a look at the factory of the future. In the factory of the future, our robot colleagues have to work independently with one another and communicate with each other. For this to work smoothly, there are now so-called campus networks. A campus network is a closed private communication network for an industrial company, for example. This mobile network consists of a private and a public part. The private network is only available on the factory premises and is not open to the public. The public part of the network can be used, for example, by external service providers for the remote maintenance of machines. Here in Schwabmünchen, near Augsburg, Osram, together with Telecom, is operating the first campus network of its kind. What does Osram need a campus network for? The campus network opens up a new dimension to us in terms of data bandwidth, data volume and latency and therefore we want to invest in this campus network and see this as central to future digitization. The factory premises therefore also has its own LTE network which in the future can be converted to the new communication standard 5G. This network docks to the public mobile network. Experts call the combination of a private and public network a dual slice solution. Mobile robots will be used in the Osram factory in the future. These so-called driverless transport vehicles will in future move autonomously on the factory premises and communicate with each other via the campus network. For this purpose, the campus network is equipped with a so-called local edge cloud. These are special servers on the factory premises, which can perform complex computing operations quickly. How does the interaction between man and machine work? The campus network is a new technology that also inspires young people. And so in the future, we will not only be able to inspire young people, but also keep them. In this way, we can transform the existing traditional site into a high-tech site. Production processes are becoming more efficient. New applications and technologies can be used. All this is only possible with the new mobile-based campus network.